Hey guys, what's going on? I'm just taking a service call this morning here at a retirement home. I have been to this quite a few times on different pieces of equipment throughout the building. Uh, they use water source heat pumps. They're about 18 years old, Climate Master units, direct drive R22 units. They're getting up there in age. I've been noticing uh, blower motors have been failing recently. And uh, I've changed uh, three in about the past four months, five months. So uh, my call was they're complaining of noise. Then there was a burnt smell. And so they just shut off the equipment. So most of the time when there's a noise, a vibration and a burning smell, most of the time it's from something rotating, such fan motor. Most likely the bearings are probably locking up and overheating the motor, causing a burning smell, your windings, everything just cooking away. So that's what I'm leaning towards at this time, but let's see. And here we are. Okay guys, service call is we have no heat. There's a noise and an odor coming from the unit. So sounds to me like we could be having a bad blower motor. That was my first suspicion when there's a, a, a smell of some sort, sort, a burning smell. So after opening up the unit and there is power currently, we do not, the LED light is not flashing any uh, fault codes, so that's good. But I'm gonna go ahead and just kill power, okay? So no power, but our blower motor, it typically will be really warm if there was a problem with it. But the customer has had this off for quite some time, so it's had time to cool down. But, see that? We got a bad set of bearings. It's just, it's getting hot and as soon as those bearings heat up, the metal expands and then locks up. So right here, automatically change our blower motor. We'll pull the whole squirrel cage assembly out, flush out this squirrel cage, new capacitor. Let's see how that goes. The new motor. That was a lot longer. On startup, you always check proper rotation. There we go. You cannot check amp draws like this because there's no load on there. Your amp draws will be skyrocketing. Shut it down and put your panels on first. The motor is rated for 2.3 amps. We are under that, which is excellent. That was a lot longer. <laughs> 